A photo of a massive alligator along the banks of an East Texas lake is getting a lot of attention online. The seasoned fisherman who spotted the gator says it might be the biggest one he's ever seen. Darden Raleigh Jaswal explains why alligator sightings like this are on the rise right now. I'm at Lake Sam Rayburn right now, and as you can see, this area that I'm standing in is usually filled with water, but because of drought-like conditions, it is dry right now, causing more alligators to be seen. Sam Rayburn right now is about five and a half foot low, so there's a whole lot more shoreline and a lot less cover for these animals to be in as they move from from shore to water. Over the weekend, fisherman Keith Combs was out catching some bait when he spotted this alligator on the shore. I've fished on that lake um, for gosh 30 years, and I've never seen one even close to that big. Combs says he's been fishing all around the world and nothing compares to what he witnessed on Lake Sam Rayburn. It makes you a little nervous to know something with a that's maybe 12 or 13 foot long is swimming right by your boat under the water and you can't see it. Experts say the best thing to do when you see an alligator is nothing at all. They don't necessarily like to be around people a lot. I just appreciate them from afar and uh, like that and let them do their thing and, and uh, you do yours. The worst thing you can do. When we start running into alligators is when we've had people that have started feeding that alligator and got that alligator used to people. And workers at the Caldwell Zoo agree. You never want to feed an alligator. That's usually what gets uh, people and alligators in trouble. And if there is a situation where public safety is involved. Or we would have to come out and evaluate and to try to determine whether or not that alligator was a threat and then figure out what the proper course to remove that alligator was. Now, if you are in the area and do happen to see an alligator, make sure you keep your pets safe and with you and to not pester the alligator as that could cause more trouble. I'm Gnarly Jaswal with CBS 19.